guys and welcome back to Far Cry 6. This is my second and most likely final video I'm going to be uploading early. I just want to save most of it for the full series, the full game when it releases. This is one of the games I'm looking forward to most this year. I don't want to spoil too much, so uh, we'll, we'll see what happens. But you guys really enjoyed that first video, and I do want to make it clear that first video was sponsored. This one is not. I'm, I'm just uploading it just because I really enjoyed the game, and I think you guys will too. So what's kind of cool is through the powers of game development, Ubisoft has transported me forward in the game. We're now actually on the island of Yada. We're like a higher level. We have more loadouts, more weapons, more stuff like that. So we can see a little bit more of kind of like a mid-game character. I think it's still fairly early game, but a little bit, you know, more progressed so uh it should be fun we'll see what happens i think we're gonna do like one or two main missions and then a, a really crazy side mission for chicharron you guys don't want to miss that and um here we go we made it into our new camp El tigre. Just out here arm wrestling fools, drinking. You're trapped. Death is staring you in the face. What do you do? <laughs> I've been kicked in the cojones a thousand times. I haven't felt them since 72. Never do that again. What? Mi casa su casa, baby tigre. Come on. Me the family. I like this guy already. My nose is broke again. I'm not your fucking mother. <laughs> Lucky mama. There are people out there who are actually hurt. I am suffering. I easy, Mama. Herpes doesn't count. <laughs> Meet Lorenzo Canseco, poet of the legends. Well, I sense the hot blood of a fighter. Our new squad. And of course, you know Lucky Mama, heart of the legends. It's not broken. Really? I felt it go crazy. Merda! Another patient? Looks like La Morale to me. I'm Dani Rojas from Libertad. The new fist of the revolution. No, Clara sent me. Libertad needs the legends on our side, heroes to believe in. To fight another Castillo? He's exactly what Yara deserves. Buena suerte. Sorry, one revolution was enough. Looks like Clara was wrong. Where's the heart? Have faith, Danny. They just need to get to know you. Come see me when you get settled. My baby tigre. Okay. If we want these cranky old guerrillas to help Libertad, we need Lucky and Lorenzo on board. So here's what we're going to do. Ever since Anton got obsessed with the cancer drugs and making Viviro, finding medical supplies for Lucky's clinic has been impossible. So I bribed a pilot to fly some in. When the supplies arrive, we tell Lucky they're a gift from Libertad, and boom, everybody's friends. Perfect. Perfect plan, right? Well, it would have been if some hijo de puta didn't shoot down my chopper. Go get those supplies before someone else does, baby tigre. All right. Remember Recover the supplies. The pretend like they came from the, uh... Always be moving. Libertatum, it should be good. So the chopper was shot down... Right over yonder. You can see the smoke still. Gosh, that is so cool. All right, here we go. Time to float on down there and, uh, let's see... We can get this back. We haven't used the wingsuit yet. Why not? This looks like the drop. What a mess. This is too easy. Que vola! Who are you? We're La Moral. And the Leste is our land. Our land, our medicine. You practice that little speech? Yeah. This is property of Libertad. Ah, Libertad. Knew you would come begging for our help. We should be fighting Castillo together. I'm Honron, second in command. Honron. So she knows how to take care of business. Bit overkill, but okay. Name's Danny, Danny Rojas. Uh huh. Company! Over there! By the chopper! Shut her up! Okay, so I was thinking we were going to be able to go stealthy with the nail gun, but I guess that's just not going to happen here. Let me see. We've got the SPAS. We've got the M16S. I'm going to try to switch things up. For our secondary, I'm going to go with the 308 carbine. And then for our primary, I'm going to go with the MP40. This is one of my all-time favorites right here. Let's get it. 
I guess we could kind of use the nail gun a little bit, but I just don't want to waste the ammo on it. All right, let's... This thing feels beefy. Kind of tempted to try to use a sniper too. They're all lined up and you couldn't hit, couldn't hit one of them. Okay, so this thing is not very good. My bad, I, uh, I wanted to try the sniper. Let me just duct tape myself up real quick. Yeah, we're, we're gonna go, we're gonna go back to the MP40 here. Much more effective. We might need to upgrade that other thing a little bit. We'll be fine. I kind of want to try it again. Hold on a second. Tried throwing a propane tank at him. There it is. That was my plan all along. Coming from the west. Got an MG up top. Come on, come on. Turn, 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 turn. Down. Beautiful. You've got talent, Libertad. But Yelena needs these supplies. We got wounded. Yelena's your boss? Yeah. She's gonna kick my ass if I don't come back with something. Gotta split him. Clara's gonna try to kick mine if I don't bring these to the legends. Libertad wants the legends of 67? Half of Yara things are dead. Oh, they're very alive. <laughs> and half of La Moral things are full of shit. But I majored in history. They paid him blood to put Anton's papa in his grave. I'll tell you what. You give me these supplies, I'll introduce you. Ah, coño. Yelena's gonna kill me. But at least I got to meet the legends first. Now, Danny, you get us a chopper. Then we can talk supplies. Welcome to La Moral. Libertad. Whatever. All right. So we've got different factions all working together. So we're going to have to take down the AA cannon. Next to an old Spanish military tower along the western coast. Okay. Let's go take care of that first, and then we're going to be able to... Uh, Bring a chopper over here. Anti-aircraft cannon first. Then we're gonna have to go grab a chopper. And then we grab the supplies. The heck was that? Come on, baby. Not sure if that's going to blow this up. I don't really know how to blow this thing up, if you want me to be honest. Yep, it did. Okay, perfect. Now we got to get in the chopper and get that out of here. Sorry, fellas. Got a blast. Had to borrow this. Uh, hopefully you don't mind. Please, please don't shoot it out of the sky before we're able to get gone. We are Audi. Okay. Does this thing have any... It's got some, some turrets on it. I don't know if it's got... Uh, it's got flares. It does not have any missiles. Just make sure you're not underneath when I shoot it down. Hopefully that's going to be good enough. Oh, man. It, it's not... It's not looking good for us. I didn't... I, I was kind of expecting to be able to take more damage, but I guess not. I'm gonna go land this next to our helipad. Okay. Not too shabby. I really want a silenced sniper to be able to one-shot people silently. Need to, uh, we've collected some gunpowder. We need to go make one. We'll make one at a workbench. Make our life ten times easier. We don't really have anything that's great at stealth right now. Especially for picking people off, because we have to fire that that single shot so many times. Makes it tough. Hey, you got the supply. <gasps> Palapinga, el tigre, feast of the revolution. You gotta sign my pants. Como se llama, señorita? Honron. Eh. I'm with La Moral. Uh, la Moral. Terroristas. Honron, this is Lorraine. I know who he is. 
I think the word he's looking for is guerrilla. You're not guerrillas. You're a street gang. At least we're not hiding on the mountain while the world goes to shit. Have you seen what's going on down there? Go, check out a Biovida facility. I dare you. The legends don't take orders from anarchists. Entiende? Enough, Lorenzo. <gasps> no, you know what? Fuck you. Oof. La moral is keeping these supplies. This is our revolution, not yours. I mean, it's already if here, I so it's not going anywhere. In the crossfire today. Took a bullet in the stomach. Without this, he won't make it to tomorrow. Lucky mama. A lot of the bullets I pull are from La Moral. There is a difference between playing with guns and fighting La Revolution. El Tigre. Okay. So they're a bit aggressive. They're big on lectures. If these abuelos want to live in their museum, whatever. I can leave Puerta. Or maybe I borrow some souvenirs. Talk to me when you got a minute. Interesting. I like that we have different backgrounds, different stories. We all kind of have the same objective, but different areas, different backgrounds, whatever, have, uh, you know, vastly different origins and personalities and such. Now, you guys see all these chickens here? I think we're going to, uh, I think we're going to swap out Guapo, our, our alligator. I think, or I think he's a crocodile. I think it's, uh, I think it's time to switch things up. Gonna go ahead and wingsuit over here, and we have uh, Chicharron. Is gonna be a, uh, I believe he's a rooster that we we might be able to befriend. I don't know. I'm just kind of curious how how everything works. So I figured we could check this out and see what we've got going on. Chicharron. 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 So you want to humiliate the army all by yourself, idiota? You're never satisfied. He likes to fight. How dare you? Oh, I he's do pretty. Everything you want, and this is how you thank me? Cabron. Go there. See if I care. What's up, little buddy? Chicharron. You try to be friends? You try to fight? Oh, what he's got a strut. Want? You try to fight some enemies with me? Take down the uh, the oppressors? Talk to Reynaldo. Reynaldo, what's going on with this chicken, my you man? You see what I put up with? Chicharron would have been a roast compoy if it wasn't for me. I took Chicharron under my wing. Trained him to be the greatest cockfighter of Yara. But then the soldados came. Tried to arrest me for smuggling cash to La Moral. Chicharron went on a rampage. When he tasted the blood of soldados, Yara's greatest guerrilla fighter was born. Dog fighting is beneath Chicharron. He has an insatiable thirst to kill those who hurt the innocent. Like an idiota, I tried to control Chicharron's rage. But now Chicharron has run away from me to kill again. He's gone after the military kennel, where soldados are breeding an army of twisted dogs trained to kill guerrillas. What? Chicharron needs a warrior to protect him from himself. I will never be a warrior like Chicharron. But you, you are a warrior. Just like Chicharron. We can make that happen. Join him. <laughs> Bro, this is so ridiculous. Rápido. Chicharron has run off to fight the dog army alone. I will not let him fight the dog army alone. I'm, I'm coming after you, Chicharron. What, but dog army? Okay, this this sounds like it's gonna be a bit of an issue. I, I I sounds like he may have bitten off a little bit more than than we can chew, but um, I'm hoping we're gonna be able to make it work. We probably, I mean, I would imagine if we're if we're fighting dogs here, I'm gonna say we we want the spas on one, and I'm gonna put a uh, a sub on two. Go ahead and go with uh, mm, what do you guys think? Let's go with the MP40, I guess. You good, bro? Hola, Chicharron. How are you doing? I'm Danny. You're more of a strong squawking type, I see. I'm not a big fan of evil dogs, apparently. He killed all three of these soldiers, and now he wants to get after the dogs. Okay. I got you, Chicharron. Let's do it. Of course. You ready? Because they're coming. I don't, I don't think they're going to wait for us. Here we go. Come on. This is ridiculous. 
The dogs are attacking mannequins as well as Chicharron. Let's go. So this must be a part of their training. They, uh, they just come out and attack the mannequins. And he's picking fights with them. So these dogs are doing nothing wrong but what they're trained to do. I feel kind of bad, but we've, I mean, we have to kill them. He's flipping out the mannequins, getting the dogs to come after him directly. I got you, Chicharro. These guys are no joke. These guys take a lot of ammo. I'm trying to get your back, Chicharron. I don't know what's better. I think our spas might be better. Chicharron hanging in there. Oh, they got big dobies here. Ronaldo, those fucked up death dogs are dead. Tore them apart. I've never seen anything like it. Once Soldado Blood touched Chicharron's beak, he was never the same. But now. I can trust that he has found a companion who will protect him on his quest for justice. Protection? It's fucking terrifying. Paint his name on the water tower. Let all who come know and hear the name Chicharron. Dude, he has lost his absolute mind. This is the most ridiculous thing. Okay, so he... He wants, uh... He wants to, to be honored. He wants to be honored as as one of the baddest fighters in the land. So we're we're gonna do we're gonna do just that. We are gonna go honor him. We are gonna paint his uh, mural on the side of the water tower. Let everyone know that he came in here and messed all these highly trained military dogs. Just took care of them, destroyed them, clawed them. with the Anarchy logo. <laughs> Bro, this game is ridiculous. There is no way something this cute should be in this video game. Are you kidding me right now? Come on, Teresa, let's go. We gotta go, we got a job to do. We got a mission to do, come on. Let's roll. Let's roll out, little buddy. Oh my goodness, he's so fast. Look at his little tool belt and everything. This is fantastic. Hello, friend. You are such a good boy. What a good boy. Thank you.